Hello, you guys. So, so I just ran to my storage unit and to Walmart. Today, we're going to go to the beach. It's like 9.40 a.m. Um, and I just put Blaine in his crib because he was, like, whining. So, sometimes, like, if he's whining for no reason and just, like, pouting, I'll just put him in his crib to let him, like, calm down. Uh, and he fell asleep, I think. So, he was tired. So we might not, so now I'm thinking we're going to wait till he wakes up. So it probably won't go till like 11. I was thinking we we're going to go at like 10, but I don't know why I'm sharing all that <laughs> actually. But yeah, I'm having a monster Java or Java monster. These are really good and they're cheaper than the Starbucks drink. Not by much, but they're cheaper. So I am going, got everything, my labels printed out. I've got all my packages. And I'm going to start packaging my orders. This is everything. Um, I sold a good amount overnight. Um, and as you know, though, my sales are terrible. They were terrible last month. And they're actually were. It was like picking up at the end of last month. It picked up. And so I thought I was on a good path. And then... Uh, it really dropped again in August. So, yeah. I'm going to do like a little time lapse while I do this so I can watch my show and package my orders. everything package I'm gonna put that outside and then I'm going to go through my inventory and clear these bag numbers out and then I don't know I'm gonna put these dishes away I guess and just wait for Blaine to wake up so we just got back from the lake I feel like I could definitely got some sun I don't know you probably can't tell <laughs> I look terrible but you know I can see like a tan line there um yeah, so I am so tired. I'm so glad to be back home. I was really thirsty for some water. And I don't honestly know what I'm going to do. I think the rest of the day, I'm just going to... It's 2.49 in the afternoon. And I think I'm just honestly going to sit down and watch TV and relax. Um, I feel like it's been go, go, go for quite a few days. So it'll be nice to just sit down. <laughs> And take a break. I, uh, Blaine, he actually went down for another nap. He's really tired, so. Yeah, I'm gonna get some dry clothes on and watch some Netflix or something. Some Netflix and chill. Okay, so it's 4.49. I am going to make the... Bro I'm gonna make supper. Um, this is gonna be that, uh, roasted broccoli that I made that one day in the oven um so i'm just getting that together i need olive oil and then we'll get some seasonings i'm gonna do the paprika and the onion and garlic powder and then that's all i'm gonna do for that and put that on a tray and i'm just going to reheat uh, the leftovers from last night um, because there's quite a bit left so we're going to eat that up again we're going to add this and then obviously the broccoli
So the kids I was babysitting just left, so I'm going to start my crock pot dinner. And Blaine is napping right now, so I'm going to try to be quiet. But it's 12.44. Typically I would start this earlier, but that's fine. Um, I already cooked up the chicken the other day, so I'm going to let this thaw. And obviously I don't have to cook the, cook the chicken, so it doesn't have to be in there as long. But it's a Fiesta crock pot chicken dinner. I need a packet of this ranch seasoning, a block of cream cheese, a couple of limes, black pepper, onion powder, chicken broth, um, corn. This is a uh, fire roasted corn, which I thought would be good. Some black beans. Um, I did not realize I got the no added salt, but that's okay. Um, and then a can of Rotel. Uh, diced tomatoes and green chilies and I'm gonna put all this in the crock pot on high and pretty much until it's all melted together and then once once it gets close to like four or something I'll add the chicken in and just let it just all sit together I just filmed my little shorts clip and I am um, I'll film the end when it's finished for my short as you can tell I've been really enjoying doing shorts I think they're a lot of fun and yeah um, so here this is I hope it turns out good because the chickens already cooked but like I said I am NOT gonna leave it in there as long as it calls for because obviously mm, the chickens already cooked so now I'm just going to do up these dishes. Um, and yeah, also I kind of wanted to, wanted to talk to you guys about my channel because I, so I just recently did a poll on my channel and it was asking you guys if you enjoy my vlogs, like my day in the life vlogs better or like my reseller content, which is like the what sold videos and the unboxings. And like I didn't get a ton of votes or anything but the unboxing the reseller content won so like the point of doing that was just to find out like how many of you are here for the reselling and how many are for the the vlogging because um obviously this channel started out as a reselling channel but his it's obviously become more of like what do you want to say like a lifestyle channel and that's really because I, I love filming these vlogs. I think they're a lot of fun and it's really the direction I've decided I think I want to take my channel. Um, and then another thing, another reason too is that I've really, I do my reselling. I work on it consistently still. I'm not seeing much for results right now. Um, you know, I've made, I made like $1,500 last month. This month I'm... I'll probably make about that much which is great for being able to stay home and work on it part-time 
but it's it's not where I want to be. I want to put more of a focus into YouTube. And so anyways, I haven't been buying like boxes and stuff to share with you guys to do unboxings. Like if I ever order stuff like that, I'll I'll make sure I film it, of course. But I haven't been purchasing those boxes. And then the What Sold videos, I just, I really don't enjoy the editing of those. Um, it's very tedious. So I just haven't done much of that. And I'm, I kind of have decided for myself that I really want to turn this channel into more like, because it was like day in the life as a reseller, it would become that. But I really decided I want this to be more of like a vlogging channel and like, yeah, I just, I have a lot more fun doing it and I really enjoy doing this. Um, this is kind of like, it's, as you can tell, I enjoy the vlogging more because I do post a lot more frequently than I did before and I can't always come up with like reseller content um, I might sprinkle that in here and there when I have stuff to film um, but yeah I just I haven't been buying inventory like I was I did purchase a really big palette from a company but it was like I wasn't gonna share that um, because you know, you got to keep some of these things secret. <laughs> you can't give it away to the competition. But, um, yeah, so I just kind of wanted to address that. Um, yeah, that poll really was just to find out. Because I noticed my videos aren't getting a lot of views and stuff. And I'm, I was like, well, I, I'm going to guess the majority of my subscribers are here for my reselling content. Um. So, I don't know, I do plan on sprinkling some reselling stuff in here, but I do, I did decide that this is going to be more of like a vlogging channel, so. Yeah, I don't know, I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, I know some of you guys enjoy it, um, but yeah. So, I just want to share that, address that. Okay, so, it like burned to the sides, but, um, there it is. We just already ate without him. Jack had his on a tortilla. I just ate mine with some sour cream. Or I used plain Greek yogurt instead of sour cream. And then an avocado or half an avocado. And I just put Blaine's in a bowl with some Greek yogurt as well. Um, Blaine's not like... He doesn't seem to eat tacos super well. Or doesn't really... I don't know. He doesn't seem to be a fan or something. So I just put it as like... Just like I ate it. Jack ate it, like I said, with the tortilla. Willie will probably eat it with the tortilla. Um, I, it was good. It was really good, actually. I think I may have added a little bit too much ranch seasoning because I did add some more. Um, oh, that was awkward. <laughs> Someone was riding by on a bike. And I was just staring out here, talking to my camera, and then they looked in here, and then they looked away quick very awkward but anyways yeah so um, I don't know why but I'm like really tired today again it's literally 4 51 so like usually we wait for Willie to get home to have supper but I'm like I just want to get everything out of the way get the kids fed and just go lay down just honestly go lay down and then Willie can feed himself <laughs> but um yeah so I am not gonna be doing anything else today I don't know if this vlog's gonna end off here or what but tomorrow we have some fun plans I'm gonna take the kids to sorry my makeup is like my makeup's all over the place it's, I need to like clean it up but um, I'm gonna take the kids to this place it's called Monkey Joe's and it's just like a bunch of inflatables that they can jump on there's like a little arcade it's super cool um, cuz I'm babysitting again tomorrow so uh. We are going to do that, and yeah, um, whew, I am, like, out of breath. Um, we went to the trampoline park today. I said we were going to go to Monkey Joe's, but instead we went to a trampoline park. Kids loved it. They had a blast. I had a blast. I don't care how old I am. I'm still going to jump on those trampolines like I'm a 12-year-old. <laughs> but, um, yeah, we had fun. So... The kids I was babysitting got picked up. Jack's got a friend sleeping over again. And we, so they got picked up. So me, Jack, Blaine, and his friend ran to the store. So I have a little mini grocery haul here for you guys. Um, 
I didn't, I just ran in super quick and just grabbed some crap, sorry, stuff. Um, and this is what I got. So I got some bananas, we ran out of bananas. I got some mac and cheeses. Um, that's for like lunches for when the kids come because a lot of people's kids are super picky eaters um, and it's hard, it's really hard to find food to feed kids when if you're babysitting. For me anyways it is. Um, Cause I, I, like my kids, I force them to eat what I make. Um, you know, if you don't like it, like too bad, like you're gonna eat it type of thing. Um, but not every parent is like that. So I do just try to stick to like generic foods for when I babysit. Um, more corn tor tortillas. Uh, these are like a healthier option and they're really good with like eggs and just whatever, they're awesome. Um, got some bread. Some more Danimals for Blaine. He loves these. We got him also some more applesauce. Um, these are the cinnamon kind. He's got a bag of lettuce. I just like to have lettuce for whatever reason. Um, corn. We're going to have one of these bags tonight. Just frozen corn. Uh, we're going to have this for supper tonight. It's just some thin cut french fries. And then we're also going to have the fish sticks. Um, when I said that, the boys, uh, Jack and his friend, seemed a little disappointed. And I'm like, really, man? Like, I used to love fish sticks growing up. Like, this was the bomb. Like, I don't know. But apparently they weren't super excited about it. But I'm going to make it anyways. Um, then this is some more lunch stuff for when I babysit. I only have three days left to babysit now. So I only had to come up with stuff for three days. But I have some spaghetti rings pasta. So this is a great value. Oh, you know what? This I got two. I meant to get two of the spaghetti and meatballs because I got a four pack of SpaghettiOs here and then I got some mini raviolis um and even if I don't use them for when I babysit um they're these are always good to have on hand and then we got some strawberries the kids love strawberries so yep that is my little Walmart grocery haul <laughs>